While the Ocrest staff members consider many of the residents their family, they do have families of their own. Started in 2008, WOCV's Baby Love program has allowed our residents to meet the newest and youngest members of the Ocrest family. For many of our staff, Ocrest is less of a job and more of a family. So when they have the opportunity to show off our community's latest additions, they jump at the chance. Though there may be some debate as to who has the cutest children. Oh, Ethan. Ethan Matthew Runkles. Hands down. Can we cue a picture of Ethan, please? <laughs> My kids are the cutest. I got to add some goals babies in there, too, because I'm telling you, they're cute. Um, mine's the cutest. Anthony, hello. <laughs> and then there's Anthony. Oh, wow. I'm going to be biased, I think. And, you know, I know people saw Brady when he was just a baby. Uh, but boy, if they could see him now, he is one cute kid. And he knows it. If I answer, it may incriminate me. <laughs> oh, my goodness. And then there's, there's um, Logan. Can't pick one. Equal love for all. And then there's, there's Callie, um, Jim's baby. I don't think I can pick one kid or group of kids that really is the cutest. Um, I'm pretty positive there's a couple staff members that would probably be pretty upset if we picked one specific one. Oh, then there's Tierce's baby. Oh, cute. While they may not be able to come to a consensus as to who has the cutest kids, it's very clear to our staff and volunteers why our residents love baby love. Residents love children, period. Well, first of all, they love children because all we see are older people around here. Babies are fun, no matter who you are. You can tell that the residents genuinely care about you as a person. When you get to know the staff members, and I see this, you know, we, we talked a few minutes ago about family, we're family. So seeing the staff members' children come in just brings that family together a little bit more. This is like a family. This is really, it, it starts as a workplace, but you really quickly start to become family members. And for them, it's almost like their great grandkids or their grandkids. They'd like to get to know you on a personal level. That's what, you know, we tell people that come in from the outside. They want to know something personal about you. They want to know, are you married? Do you have kids? They like that. It's not the kind of place where you're just at a job. Like, you're a part of the fabric of their life. And I feel like when we have a life event like that, you know, they've lived those life events themselves. Some people have 12 kids, you know, and they realize what a big mark that is for us. And I just think it's fun for them to be part of our life and we open up ourselves to them every day to be part of our life. We have a show like Baby Love, it's great. We're able to bring our children in here for the residents to enjoy. The residents literally watch our children grow up on camera sometimes. They love the staff that they work with. I think they, we really strive to have relationships with the residents here at Ocrest to be as close as we possibly can with them. Um, me personally, I grew up with the residents here. Um, I've been here 12 years, so they watched me grow up almost from a baby, and now they get to see their baby having babies. And they get to kind of see the babies grow up. So, and I mean, every time that shows on, the residents love it. Every time. And we like to bring them on. <laughs> I like to show them off. I can't get enough of you, baby.